Hey, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. This is Praveen here. And from tomorrow, we are starting the DevOps and SRE Batch 10 project classes. In that Batch 10, you are going to get a dedicated one-to-one -one mentorship with job guidance where I'm going to help your uh, preparation from basics to advanced for DevOps and SRE. So if you are looking for upskilling in the next two to three months, check out the link in description and right away enroll yourself for the projects which are going to be real time from zero to hero. Also, I'm going to help you with the interview questions of various companies that I have cracked in this year, like Cisco, Adobe, and uh, I have recently cracked JP Morgan Chase. All those things also will be given you uh, given to you in the form of documents. Also, your resume will be prepared in terms of ATS friendly, your LinkedIn profile optimization, your job search, everything I'll be helping you from scratch. So what are you waiting for? Go ahead and check out the batch 10. The links are in the description. And one more thing to uh, everyone, just to update you all, many of you are watching out my channel, but it's a clear evidence from the YouTube analytics that 60% of you have not subscribed to the channel, but still watching the channel. So I think from this video, I'm going to give you different kinds of cheat sheets that are going to help you. So if you need any kind of tools cheat sheet, let me know in the comment section, which kind of uh, uh, cheat sheet you need, whether the Linux cheat sheet, which I'm going to provide you right now is helpful to you or not. Let me know. Also, if you are able to see every cheat sheet, whatever I'm going to provide you, it will be very helpful to you. You have to just make sure that you take out the printout of the cheat sheet and attach it on any of your wall so that whenever you are uh, waking up in the morning or doing your work, you just see the cheat sheet. And with that, you will remember because in interview, some of the interviewers ask the command. So for them, this cheat sheet will be very much helpful. So let's get started into the video. So all of you, let me tell you, this cheat sheet is designed in such a way that A to Z means A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, W, X, Y, Z. So different kinds of commands under each of the segments uh, will be uh, dedicatedly given to you. So let's say like I started with A, right? Earlier in the childhood, we used to uh, study like A for Apple, B for Paul. So similarly, you will be reading the Linux like this. A, for example, for with the alphabet A, what are the commands? Add user, add group, right? Alias, anachron, approps, apt, apt get, arp, ar, aspel, as, at, awk. So these all are the commands which resides under the letter A or which starts with the letter A. So if you are seeing this cheat sheet, this cheat sheet will also have some description beside each of the command, which is going to help you in your job search. Similarly, if we go ahead with the B, uh, like base name, base 32, base 64. So for your information, base 32 and base 64 are the data encoding and decoding, uh, uh, you can say like commands, which are going to help you in Linux. Uh, bash, anyways, you know, BC, BG, uh, bind, which is used to attach some socket uh, uh, to a name, uh, break, built, uh, built in, uh, bzip to bz cmp, bz diff, bz grep, bzip to bz less, bz more. These all are commands for calling different kinds of uh, functionalities. Let's say if I say like bzip to compress or depress, uh, de decompress a file, like you have zip, you have tar, you have gzip. So similarly, like bzip to. So similarly, if you see C, uh, we have cal, calor, case, cat. Anyways, you are aware of the cat command. CF desk, which is a partition table manipulator for Linux. Uh, C chatter, uh, CH group, CH mod, CH own. CH mod and CH own are very important whenever uh, you are going to uh, learn these kind of things will definitely help you change owner and change group, uh, change permissions, right? Access permission, ch mod triple seven, right? File name, you do ch password, ch p a s s w d to change any kind of password related to the uh, users, right? Uh, ch f n used to change the real username and information, ch root, uh, whenever you are going from one user to another user, let's say like I want to go from a normal root user to the super root user. So you use ch root command, ch sh, check config, check sum, <coughs> clear, comparing to file, cmp, com, command, compress, continue, cp, copy command, cpo, uh, cron, cron tab, cron cron tab are very much helpful in terms of automation. So make sure that you are going over this particularly, curl, curl, I have to tell you specifically because most of the Linux uh, people use it, hit the URL, get the data, and uh, mostly the curl is used to um, get any kind of files from the URLs which are present in the internet or any kind of data which we need to get from a URL. Curl is particularly used. 
Uh, this curl command is very, very much important and almost all the tools automations are residing with the, uh, with this curl command itself. So let's say like D, uh, you already have date display, uh, desk, <coughs> desk calculator, DC, right? D, D, D rescue, declare, diff, uh, diff is again, uh, to find the differences between two files, diff three, dig, D, I, G, the DNS, uh, lookup, uh, D, I, R directory, uh, related things, uh, D, I, R colors directory name directories dos to unix to convert anything uh, any text format right format converter dos to unix dmesg print kernel name dpkg package manager similarly you have yum uh, for uh, sent os you have apt for uh, your ubuntu similarly dpkg is a package manager for debian and ubuntu du estimated disk usage du is always like a disk usage uh, there are many other commands let's go ahead E, eco, egrep, enable, env, Linux environment variables, eth tool, eval, execute, exec, exit, expand, export. These all are residing under the E. I am not telling like you need to know everything, but whatever I am stressing, you can concentrate on that. For example, if you go with F command, FD format, F disk, which is very much important for your disk partitioning. Let's say like I have, I have attached a 10 GB of disk to my system. How I am going to partition the system disk space based on using the command like F disk. Okay. Uh, FG F grep file determine the file type find very important command in Linux with this almost 20 to 30 percent of automations resides with the find command very much important. You need to go with that and F FMT formatting uh, basically uh, if you are doing any kind of formatting uh, you can see that uh, or reformat the paragraph or any kind of text fold for format free. Free will give you the disk availability. Uh, file system check, FSC, right? FSCK, <coughs> file system check, uh, file system consistency check and repair, FTP file transfer protocol, function F user. These all are very much important for any kind of Linux engineers. If I go with the G command, G awk, find and replace a text file, G, what is this? Sparse positional parameters, G to tops. Uh, grep very much important group add adding a group uh, adding a user security group group del delete a group group mod modify a group group so if you see in the g uh, almost all the commands are with respect to your uh, group related things which are very much important head if we start with h hash head help history host name right and uh, password paste file these all things play an important role uh, if you see with uh, let's say like um, p uh, path check perf right performance analysis tool in linux ping pg grep p kill p p p o p d p r print cap print environment print f p s for process uh, push p v p w d present working directory q quota quota check r ram r c p read read array read only reboot rename uh, r m removing r m d i r removing the directory r sync remote file copy these all things are literally important guys yes uh, the letter yes, singam, right? Uh, screen, SCP, SCP diff, uh, SED, uh, SEQ, SET, SFTP, secure file transfer protocol, uh, shaft, uh, shaft generate, shutdown, sleep, very much important. Uh, SSH secured shell, stat, trace, SU, substitute user identity, sync, suspend, uh, I, I, if you come, ID, I, if config, if down, right? Uh, these all things are related to I. Uh, very, very much important. If you go ahead a little bit uh, on the other side of this, uh, if you see K, kill, kill hyphen nine. So we use kill command to uh, delete any process or kill the process which is running in the system. L, uh, less let link LN, link is to create any kind of uh, links for your current existing files. Local, locate, log name, log out, look, LPC, LPR, print, LP, print D. Uh, LSBLK very much important listing the block of devices that are attached to your uh, Linux box. LS LS off LS off is again an important command list of open files, right? LP uh, LSPCI list of PCI devices M make command M file MKDIR mount uh, MTR MV very much important. If you go with N netcat netstat no hub notify send ns lookup so if you see all these things are very very much important if you go with let's say like t tall tar tar is again a command which is used which is helpful in uh, converting your uh, disks right times touch top uh, trace root again trace root to host uh, uh, trust t sort 
right ultimate document this is going to be right you uh, you mount an alias you name you an expand unrar unset unshar uh, user add user del user mod these are user related things if i have created an user i want to modify user user modify user mod i want to delete the user user del i, I want to add a user user add so these all things if you go to w where is which while who am i w get w get is same like your uh, linux curl command uh, but in this uh, the authentication is not available like curl hyphen u hyphen p similarly w w get hit the url get the data there is no like you cannot give any authentication things xyz xargs xxd xz yes zip and all those things are there very much important if i go ahead with the <coughs> with executing the commands this is going to be the ultimate cheat sheet for you where you see each of the command is going to be uh, hands on for you. So what you have to do is once you get this uh, video, you can go ahead with each of the uh, command and this also you can take it to print out, uh, attach, attach it on the screen and it will be very much helpful to you whenever you are waking up, you can just see. So here also the entire uh, Linux commands have been distributed in terms of your uh, uh, operations. Okay, so file operations, disk operations. So whatever you have seen in the previous slide, all the things we will take it and we will do the hands on if you see basic file operation ls hyphen lh touch copy move right ls hyphen lah pwd stat wc file type if you see file weaving i want to view a file cat tack more less head tail nl and string if i want to print a text you use echo printf yes sequence and clear if you want to do a file search locate which where is fine if you want to directory travel cell you use cd cd dot dot cd uh, slash cd slash temp if you want to do the disk management if i want to show you df hyphen h df hyphen u uh, uh, and uh, disk usage and uh, mount uh, unmount u mount is also important uh, file system check f s c k which we have seen in the previous commands but here you can see like what command is giving you a more uh, apt things right ssh into the other system ssh Traw is a username, you can say at the IP address, ssh hyphen key gen hyphen t rsa is again uh, uh, a command which is generating a ssh key pair in the in the rsa type, ch mod, ch mod, ch mod, ch group. So if you are able to see everything which is needed for you in one shot data point is here, right? So you need to take the printout of this. Ideally, if you are able to see process management is again important ps px ox top command kill as i have told you k k stands for kill uh, ping uh, if you see networking commands ping ip if config who is route ss net stat dig so whatever you have seen a b c d e f g h i j k l everything is in this uh, commands you can just go over that if i want to go over with uh, archives and unarchives tar right gun zip zip g zip these are the linux commands which are available if you want to go with groups Group, group add, group del, group mod, uh, user del, uh, user mod, g password, g password, password, password draw. Uh, if you want to go ahead with uh, any other data points, all of them are here. So ultimately what I'm going to tell you is those who are uh, starting their career with Linux, those who are looking out to upskill with Linux things, let me know in the comments how this, uh, how this uh, cheat sheets have helped you. And also I would like to know if you need any kind of this cheat sheets where I'm coming and explaining you some data points where I'm telling you what is a command doing, you can definitely let me know in the comment section. I'm going to bring you Kubernetes, Docker, Terraform. So which cheat sheet you need, let me know in the comment section. And if you have seen this video till here, make sure you are subscribing, subscribing to the channel and sharing the channel link with your friends. So looking out for your comments in the comment section and uh, hit a like. Uh, so make sure that you are liking this video uh, before going ahead from this video. So let's meet in the next video. This is Praveen here. And those who have joined batch 10, thanks a lot for believing me. I'll definitely stand on your uh, expectations. And tomorrow we are going to start the project work. So see you all there. This is Singham signing off from this video. Please take care and bye.